Howdy YouTube! Welcome to our new video series called Tool Tech Tips. I'm PPC's Matt, and I'll be teaching you guys a little bit about some tools that you may not have seen in our store. These are tools that I find very useful for building or modding PCs, and I just want to give you guys a little bit of a how-to, some tips and tricks, and maybe some of my favorite features about them. In our very first episode, I want to teach you guys about Barrel's Bending Mandrel. Now this is one of my favorite bending tools, purely because it's so versatile. You've got a bunch of different options on how you want to bend things, and it's really easy to use. So I'll cut the jibber jabber, let's jump into it. Alrighty, so let's say we want to make about a 45 degree angle, roughly 7 inches down the tube, or from the end, if that is easier for you to understand. So we've got our angle adjustment set. Now we just need to line up our end adjustment here, tighten up the thumb screws, and now we'll be ready to bend our tube. So all we need to do next is heat her up. So once you're certain that your tube, tube has been heated thoroughly enough, go ahead and place it in your bending mandrel here. And once it's in position, you're just going to have to hold until it cools. So there you go. We have one 45 degree angle, seven inches down the tube. So now the great part about this tool in my opinion is the fact that it can do compound bends. What I mean by that is now we can line up a second bend. So let's say that we wanted to have a 90 degree bend five inches from our first bend. All we'd have to do now is take our slider, loosen it up, slide it down to the five inch mark, I'm sorry for those of you that use metric measurements. I usually do. And now we're going to want to heat up our tube again, right in the area where we're going to want to bend it, obviously. Alrighty, now that it's hot, let's place it back in our mandrel. And there you have it. So there is your compound bend, with one of them being a specified distance away from the first. So in my opinion, there really isn't an easier way to do that. I know we do sell quite a few different mandrel kits and measuring or bending kits, whatever you want to call them. And uh, many of them are very good and they come with some measuring devices and whatnot. But for just a one-time purchase tool, all-in-one deal, you really don't get any more than the barrel bending tool. Thank you everyone for checking out episode one of Tool Tech Tips. If you want to buy one of these tools, just check the links in the description below. If you want to see more, please hit that like button and subscribe so you don't miss the next one. We will be coming back with more soon. Other than that, I hope you all have a great day and happy water cooling.